than this one. I'm going to start with this unusual cucumber. Guys, this cucumber is really unusual. So let's try it out if it's really sweet. Mmm. 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 Not bad. Hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel so i'm gonna be showing you my typical night routine and guys my typical night routine on the weekend is like very chilled very relaxed and you know very 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 easy and slow so usually i would just take my bath and you know clean my face with some you know cerave um cleansing um cleaner foaming cleaner and after that i would usually moisturize but guys with the weather and the hematan and the dryness and the humidity and the heat <clears throat> guys i'm doing very small minimal moisturizing when i say minimal very very minimal and guys this is because i sweat a lot and with this hematan i'm trying so very little 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 moisturization very little moisturizing because whenever i stay i have dry skin and whenever i stay use the ac for a while my skin becomes so dry so hence why i'm doing this moisturizing moisturizing and guys it's just very easy as my hair is already tied up and so they're touching my face and yeah that is basically all i do so by this time if i have my bad guys I'm a foodie, so I've already had dinner. But I have these cravings at night where I, you know, I like sweet thing. I'm a sweet, a sweet tooth, sweet tooth kind of person. So guys, I have been learning instead of snacking on things that are not healthy for me, I snack on things that are healthy. So shortly you'll be seeing what I'm snacking on. So let's go and have some snack. Guys, it's time to have some snack. So I have here with me this very unusual cucumber. Mm. Guys, I like this cucumber it looks so funny. I usually would wash it with salt and then start copying on it. And I have this very big orange. So it's really big for my hands. So what I do is that I shred it into small pieces so I can, you know, gulp it all down. So because this one is sweeter than this one, I'm going to start with this unusual cucumber. Guys, this cucumber is really unusual. So let's try it out if it's really sweet. Mmm. 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 Not bad. I think I like it. Mmm. I think I like it. I want to eat. Mmm. It's crunchy too. Because I want to make sure I'm eating something that is really good. This dent here is quite suspicious. But I've already washed it. And I paid over it. But I don't know with no more meat. This cucumber is like a whole dinner. It's so big. So guys, I have this habit where I'm reading something, I know, and I'm not really a typical book book person, I'm more of a digital book, I do audio books, but sometimes if I go to bed, I usually would read, and I've been doing two chapters every night before I go to bed. Now the trick is for me to finish a book. For this year, I've read up to four books, I've read, um... I've read um, um, the ABCs of parenting. I've read the woman, her lord, and her king by T.D. Jakes. And I just finished the book. I finished it. Um, um, every um, every woman, how to be a helpmate, how to be a helpmate. 
Okay, so those are the books I've read. So this one I just started with and it is titled The Principles and Power of Vision by Dr. Miles Moron. And I just started, so I'm just in the I'm in the second chapter. I just put like a, a card. And this book is really special to me because my boyfriend gave me this book. And so I've been, you know, posting it when I'm going to read it. So I'm going to finish it before the end of this month so i'm doing three chapters two chapters every night before i go to bed it's like my typical routine most of the books i've read are all on my phone so once i finish snacking i'm going to head into bed you know for today i won't because i have to you know do some um editing and maybe do some messages on social media then i finally go to bed but first of all i have to finish this food guys I have devoured the orange and I've finished my unusual cucumber and I've also read about three pages on my book. So right now it's time to wash up and then come back and head into bed. Guys, it's time for me to go to bed. But one thing, one productive thing I like to do before going to bed, because it's the weekend, I don't usually do this every night. I usually do it like um, for the new week. Is that I write out my, you know, my schedule for the day. I already have everything in my head, but I run it down one more time. Classes when I'm supposed to start. Doing this for the day and all the errands I have to run in between, it helps me to prepare my mind for my classes. So I already have some written down. So I'm going to just make sure that everything is okay. And there were some I remember, so I want to make up for that. So guys, I would usually write out um, all the things I had in my head, some routines I've already had for classes, the session each of my clients will be taking. And most of the times I remember everything. Other times in between, I remember and I come back. So I would usually read. I've already read two chapters earlier, so I'm going to add at least three. Sorry, not two chapters, three pages. I'm going to add additional three pages and then you know, find a way and get back to bed. So guys, if, you're, if you've watched this video up until this point, remember to hit that subscribe button, turn on your not, your post notifications so you know when I post new videos. And guys, I'm giving you marathon content all through December and let's see how it goes. Maybe I will even take it up until next day, but taking it one step at a time so guys when i finish reading like in between when i'm reading i could just randomly remember something and you know i could get distracted but sometimes i could also remember something and try to you know write it down so it depends on how my mood is for the night and you know just make it um, um simple and you know like for instance right now i just remembered something so i had to look for my pen and i jotted it down and you know it was time to go off i hope you enjoyed this video please do not forget to hit that subscribe button turn on your post notification and if you are if this video really relates to you you can drop a very good comment and guys i'll see you in my other vlog by tomorrow so guys stick around there are a lot of things coming up I'm trying to give you guys unusual content, like not my typical way, but you know, in the spirit of sharing Christmas and you know, sharing something, we're going to be doing this. So, thank you so much for sticking around. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.